Scene 05, Dolly Shot, take one. Welcome to Yuga Wood, Uganda's fledging movie industry. Yuga Wood movies are fast becoming the film of choice in Uganda's capital Kampala. The country's filmmakers may only have limited production skills, equipment and funding, but they are determined to grow the industry until they can compete with more established film industries. In uh, Hollywood, they have um, big budget movies and uh, low budget movies. In uh, Uganda, we have no budget movies. So we do what they call guerrilla filmmaking. We have to rely on the few resources that we have to come up with something that is good. With Nollywood dominating the African film market, there is little room for other countries on the continent to shine. About 30 movies are released every year in Yugawood, compared to 70 every week in Nigeria's Nollywood. In order to make an impact, the movie industry still needs a big push. At the moment where the film industry is, is uh, I could say at its it's, it's uh, you know, mid-level. Now it needs the push. And how does an industry get a push? The industry gets a push by us creating a cinema-going culture, all right? Plus, we need a lot of media support. The film industry needs to have media support in order for us to make the noise and create the cinema-going culture. For there to be a future for Yugawood, those in the film industry have to work a lot harder in improving their quality in order to tap into a market that is getting more and more interested in local productions. The future is always bright. Any future, the future is always bright. As long as we are consistent and we continue doing what we love doing passionately, we continue making good products, people will appreciate you. Why wouldn't they? The Last King of Scotland, an award-winning movie based on Uganda's dictator, Idi Amin, was filmed in Uganda and although Hollywood produced, its success has been buoyed on the local film industry in Kampala. The Oscar-winning movie cast had several Ugandan actors and included a number of local crews that are now using the experience gained on their own films. Alan Chiro, CCTV, Kampala, Uganda.